In this video, we'll go over a list of the best remote podcast recording services available. Number one, Zencaster. As a browser-based web app, Zencaster uses everyone's computer's local storage to record. Free users get MP3 recordings, while premium members can access the full lossless WAV files. Once the recording is over, the files automatically upload and the host can download each person's individual audio track. Depending on your subscription level, there are post-processing options too, which can be run directly from the app. Additionally, Zencaster is beginning a beta test for video call recordings as well. Number two, Squadcast.fm. This browser-based option is similar to Zencaster, however, it allows you to see your guest video. Unfortunately, it doesn't support video recording. That feature is just to make the conversation flow better. It does record the audio as it streams, keeping each person's track separate, but only in the cloud. Now, this is great if something happens since the audio will be saved in the cloud, but if someone has a bad connection, that audio that's breaking up constantly is what is being recorded, unlike Zencaster. Number three, Ecamm Call Recorder. For Mac users, that's right, Mac only, this is a top-notch option. Not only can you capture the audio from the call, but the video too. It will save on your computer, letting you edit and manipulate the file however you please. The quality of the recording is based on the quality of the connection. It does have the option to split the audio or video into separate tracks. The primary downside is that besides being Mac only, it also only works with Skype. So you're locked into that platform. Number four, Zoom. This is the now ubiquitous video conferencing software. Zoom lets you record your calls with audio and video, but from the host side. It is a premium feature and you also don't get separate tracks. However, with a mobile app, desktop software, and a browser-based app, Zoom is accessible and featureful anywhere you need to record from. So you can be remote from your studio, hop into call, and still record a remote guest without worry. Keep in mind, however, that the free version is limited to 40-minute calls at a time. So although you could technically record your screen and get around that premium feature, you would be limited to 40 minutes. And finally, number five, Discord, Skype, or Zoom with Audacity. The simplest way to record a podcast remotely is this. Get on a voice call using Discord, Skype, Zoom, or even over the actual phone with someone, and you both record your audio on your own computer. Then you upload the files to the cloud, the editor downloads them, splices them together, and boom, instant podcast. If you trust your guests and co-hosts to do it right, this is the way to get the highest quality audio. You can control the local environments and not worry about call quality at all. And you can export into lossless formats like WAVE. That said, if you worry about the technical abilities of your co-hosts and guests, you may want to either avoid this one or give it a few trial runs. Then there you go. Those were five ways you can remotely record podcasts. If you enjoyed this video, then be sure to give it a like and subscribe for more content. With that said, thanks for watching and we'll catch you in the next one.